Okay, so um, I'm having an interview with Mr. Harry Horowitz. Hello, Mr. Harry Horowitz. So, I hear that you're the brother of uh, Henry the Hobo, the uh, famous fuzzy comedy internet star. Yeah. Yes, I am. Thanks, it is right across, uh -huh, right across the lawn. Hush puppies! Shut up! Yeah, he's always asking me for cigarettes, drugs, and oh, if he can have some fun with my wife. I don't know why he does that. But anyway, it's, no, this it isn't about him, yeah. He can love it. Yeah, I'd better. He might want to come in. Or he might try to come in. Oh, he can't. Well, Let me in, Fudge Munch! How'd you get the collar off? I don't know. I hired a, a pig. Oh. Yeah, I put a shock collar on him and I put a fence around so when, whenever he goes past the fence, it was shocks and they crazy. Did the fence include the door? No. It includes his box for a house. Whenever he whenever he gets within twenty if he's within twenty feet he's fine. If he gets out from the twenty feet foot range, he's gonna wanna get back in quick. Okay. Anyway, this isn't about him, this is about me. Alright, Mr. Horowitz, um I wanna know about your pets and your wife and your children. Well, first, I'll tell you about my pets. It, it, as you can see, my first pet's not here. He's out on the walk in the woods with my wife with a size 20 extra large collar on. We call him Bob, but sometimes we call him Bullcrap. And where'd you get that name from? My wife said something. I said something, my wife said Bullcrap, and, well, my pet bear, I like that. Yes, it's a bear. Yes, I, I heard on the internet that your pet bear much enjoys steak. Yes, he also enjoys little black bears. And how do you know this? We, we bought a female black bear. We thought he was a grizzly, uh, a black bear, but, and so he was a grizzly. Sorry if I, like, make mistakes in my words. I'm just, like, really excited. And for, for the interview, okay? Yeah, and, well, we put her in there, and the next morning, it was only a skeleton of her. Well, uh, tell me about your wife and your children. Oh, you, you don't want to hear about my other pet? We call him Crocky. What is it? Oh, the giant American crocodile. Wow. Uh, uh, he's, about, he's about 30 foot long. Just uh, tell me about your, uh, your children. Oh, no, your wife first. Oh, my wife? I have no idea how, I actually have no idea how I met her. I woke up one minute, one day, in the middle of a desert, looked at my hand one minute, and there was a nice steel ring, which I, of course, took off and put it in my safe, because it was worth a lot of money. Then this random woman just came up and said, Hi, honey. I'm thinking, what the freak? Who is this woman? It's Mrs. Horowitz. Yes, that is her name. What's her real name, like Linda? I don't know. She never told me. Mm -hmm. She still won't. What a wife. Mm. Um, tell me about your children. I I heard they're five years old and they're into drugs. Yes. I wonder how they got cigarettes and drugs. They came home one day with a pack of cigarettes and a bunch of cocaine and stuff. Uh, I, how long ago was that? So, a couple hours. Shit, I dropped that stuff on the way home. Really? I never, yeah. Accidentally, I didn't know, I didn't know the Horowitz children would get into these things. I mean, well, open up your hand. Open up my hand? What is that? A pencil eraser. Why? Because they ended, up, they ended up coming home with my favorite drugs. Oh. And a couple of Botox things I used on my wife. <laughs> really? So, um, thank you, Mr. Horowitz, for this very, uh, shocking piece of information. Um, I'll be, I'll be going now, and, uh, see, see you later. Okay.